Hi guys, LNDR Tom here from LFGC and again today I've got a unboxing for a charging dock that I've ordered which is a Venom twin docking station for the Xbox Series console and now I ordered this because the previous one that I had uh, was for the Xbox One um, as you know having a Series console the battery pack on the back of a controller uh, which looks the same when you actually try and put the old case on the back of it it actually is a different fit now because of this uh, the old docking station doesn't work with the new controller and if any of you have been following the channel for a little while now you would have seen that i've done a short on my elite controller uh, elite 2 controller which had some real shoddy uh, repair and ship from xbox i ended up sending that controller back to amazon who were great and gave me a full refund nearly a year and a half after owning the controller um they've sorted all that out for me and i'm really disappointed with xbox for it and i've m put up a massive complaint to them uh with how i feel that the company's gone recently and i got such a bad response from them just saying basically thank you for my feedback that i took up a further complaint and they're now looking into it fully um so hopefully something will come from that but because i haven't got the elite 2 controller anymore which was docked on my desk uh obviously it has a an internal battery in it um now this one uh, that i've got has just got normal batteries in it and i've also got um the original black one that come with my series s uh, sorry series x and i've got a white one uh with my series s but I don't um, use that as often. But because I've got two controllers now and they need uh, batteries, AA batteries, I thought I'd best get a docking station uh, so that I can charge them rather than mess about with batteries. As the other night, my batteries were low and then I'm scrambling for some batteries or the other controller to use in the meantime while playing online. So I thought I'd get this Venom one. Uh, I've had loads of Venom stuff in the past. Uh, I've always rated it. So I thought I'd just do a quick unboxing for this. So this is the twin docking station by Venom for use with Xbox Series X and S and apparently the Xbox One as well. Um, yeah, not sure how that will work because the battery packs are different, but maybe the old style battery pack does slot on the back. So let's get the box open and have a look. So before we go into the detail of what's inside the box, I thought I'd just show you the back of the box, just in case anyone's interested. So on the back, you can see what it looks like. You just drop, drop the controllers into place like you do with most docking stop, uh, stations. Uh, dock and charge up to two controllers for the Xbox Series S and X or Xbox One controllers so you are ready to play any time. USB powered docking station will also charge while your machine is on standby. Uh, LED chargers that go green and red, I assume. Um, you've also got an additional port on the back, which is quite handy, a USB port. And then you've got two batteries and two battery covers. So let's have a look inside so the box. Upon opening the box, as predicted by myself, there's not going to be much in the box um, from reading what was on the back of the box. Uh, but I'll show you what's inside. So you've got a Venom sticker, which I'll probably stick to my PC desk inside. Uh, you've got the user guide, as usual, uh, which actually is online. It's just a bit of card. Um, and then you've got the dock itself, which I'll get out. So you got the dock, which that's just dust, which is good. I thought that was damaged then. Yeah, you got the dock, so the pins for the batteries just sit on that. You can dock two controllers, so we'll just test it. So let's see what it looks like. Obviously, they've not got the battery packs in, uh, so they're just sitting on there. But yep, yeah. so the batteries would go in, and then they would sit on there, and then here and here would illuminate like usual um so i'll set that up so you can see that as well just for anyone that's never used one of these before but yeah so you've got your dock the extra usb uh, point which it said on the back of the box which is a nice nice addition i like that and then you've got the 
USB-C uh, for the plug-in. Now, if we go back over to the box, I'm assuming that's going to be in here. So what do we have here? So we've got a nice USB to USB-C cable. We've got, if I don't drop it, we've got the back, I'll drop it again, the back uh, piece for the controller, two of them, and the batteries inside here. So let's get that out so you can have a look. So that goes in the back of the Xbox controller with that over it, and then that bit is what connects on there. So let me put these together the controller you don't need to see me do that and we'll come back to it all plugged in and i'll show you how it lights up just before we go into docking the controllers uh, which i've now got this one connected and the battery pack in for this one i've just realized why this is compatible with the xbox series consoles and the xbox one console now it actually comes with four of these back plates for the controllers now they all look the same at a glance and I did wonder why there was four um, when I opened the box I've just realized why and that is because if you look on the back these ones are for the Xbox Series S and X and this one is actually for the Xbox One now what they've done is they've actually combined this one docking station to be able to suit both consoles which I think is actually really good and this actually only cost me £15 on the Black Friday deal um, as you can see you get two Xbox One uh, backs and you get an Xbox Series S and X back uh, sorry two Xbox Series S and X backs but I've got that one already in here so as you can see that it actually does uh, accommodate for both consoles which is pretty good now obviously you need to find the one that you need for your controller so we need the X and S one so we just connect that on simply like that and if we drop it into the dock as you see they both are charging so the red indicates that they're charging green indicates that they are fully charged um i do think this is actually a really good bit of kit because it does suit both consoles which i didn't realize um i did wonder how that would work but yeah i would highly recommend this this has just got a different usb uh in there at the moment because i didn't want to unwind the other one but this is what it would look like while it's charging they would go green when they're fully charged and then you're good to go so I'll set that up on my desk properly at some point and have it ready to go so I can just drop my controllers in as and when. So this is now the end of the video for the twin docking station for use with Xbox Series consoles and the Xbox One. I would highly recommend it for anyone because the one previous that I had was just for the Xbox One, uh, which obviously is no good for the Series console, but this one does i think it retails at 19.99 normally but i did get it on amazon recently for 15 pounds which i think it is still on there for so if you're interested then i highly recommend getting this i'll drop you a link in the description below